In this video tutorial we're going to make a tree skirt for the holidays. Hi, thanks for stopping by. This is Teresa from Semi Dolls. It's time for another freebie of the month. All my free patterns can be downloaded in my Facebook group in the file section. The link is down below. And if you do not have a Facebook account, you can send me an email via my website. Let's get started. I take two large pieces of fabric and fold them in half. Assemble the pattern piece as indicated. I then folded a large newspaper and cut out another pattern piece. Like this. I repeated this and put those two pieces together. This is a quarter of the tree skirt. So this will make it easier to cut out the batting and the backing fabric. I then drew around the pattern piece onto the fabric and cut it out while adding a seam allowance of 1 cm or 0.4 inches all the way around it. I now have two half tree skirts from the backing fabric. Excuse my foot in the picture. To cut the batting, I put the backing fabric piece on top of the folded over batting, making sure I'm not adding the seam allowance and cut it out. This is what it looks like. I then cut open one side of the batting for the back opening of the tree skirt. Now I'm sewing both backing halves together along one side. I'm leaving the other one open for the back opening of the tree skirt. I then put the back fabric on top of the batting and basted the two layers together along the outer edges. I then cut out the panels for the top of the tree skirt by cutting four panels each from four different fabrics so that I end up with 16 panels. To assemble the top of the tree skirt I start off by assembling two of the 16 panels each. And I cut them out again with a 1cm seam allowance. But this is all explained in detail in the pattern when you download it. I then sew two of those double panels together and then I sew two of these newly made panels with so four segments together along one edge. As usual I hope the pictures explain it more than my limited language here. <laughs> Now I have two half tree skirts. I then put them right sides together and sew them together along one edge, leaving the other one open for the back opening of the tree skirt. Then I pin the top of the tree skirt right sides facing on top of the back piece. At the back opening I pin three ribbons each into both sides of the opening. You could also use buttons to create the back closure. And I apologize for this terrible camera perspective because you can't really see what I'm doing here but I hope it'll be good enough to understand what I mean.
So all the way around, leaving a turning hole between two of the ribbons of the back closure. Clip the corners and curves. Turn the tree skirt inside out through the turning hole. Close the turning hole by hand. And then we're done. I'm really happy that we have a tree skirt now to hide that ugly stand that our tree is standing on. <laughs> and I hope it'll be a useful pattern for you as well. I would love to see your pictures in the Sammy Facebook group if you feel like sharing the picture of your project. And I hope I see you next in the next video again. Bye! Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the video and it was useful to you. Please give it a like if you like, subscribe for more videos, leave a comment with feedback and video requests. And if you like, head on over to Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. I'd love to connect with you over there. See you next time. Bye.